Hi, hello everyone. Hope you're doing well. It's me again. My name is Brenda Bussein. I work for the Imperial County Office of Education as the STEAM Hub Lead for Expanded Learning Programs. And I have another amazing STEAM activity to do with you. So the summer is here and I have an awesome activity to that you're gonna enjoy. So for this activity, we're gonna need half a cup of salt, four teaspoons of sugar, some vanilla flavor or any flavor that you like, half and half cream, a bucket of ice, two Ziploc bags, one small one, this one is the quart, this one is the gallon. Do you think we could do ice cream with what we have here? Write it in your STEAM notebook and come back. Let's make some ice cream. You're gonna grab your small Ziploc and pour the sugar and you're gonna pour some vanilla flavor or the flavor that you like the most is to be chocolate, strawberry, just a little bit. Now that you have everything in your bag, you're gonna squeeze a little bit for the air to come out and then you're gonna close it. This is ready. So now you're gonna grab your big gallon Ziploc and you're gonna pour some ice. Now that you have all the ice, you're gonna pour the salt. Pour it press back where the air to come out. Right, hold. Grab the towel, put it in the middle. Wrap it around, and there. So discuss with your family how do you think this phenomena occurs, write it in your STEAM notebook and come back. Discussion with your family why this phenomena occurs. So we just experienced an endothermic chemical reaction. reaction. Remember we added salt to the big bag and the ice. The salt forces the ice to get colder and it borrows heat from the objects around it. So as we shake the bag, the bag got colder and colder and colder, creating ice cream. So this is how we make ice cream. I wash my bag. Today we learn about endothermic chemical reactions and I hope you enjoy your ice cream. Thank you for watching.